Hi guys, I am Neha from About Technology and once again I am back with a new video where we will be discussing about two networking devices, modem and a router. We will also discuss about their differences. So guys, without any further delay, let's start with the video. You might have heard or you might have came across the term modem many times especially when you try to connect your system to internet. Modem is a device that is essential for connecting your system to internet. Well, the modem receives signals from your internet service provider over the telephone line and convert that signal into digital signal. This is because your computer can access digital signals only. When you upload something on internet, the modem modulates the digital signal from your computer to analog signal that can be carried over the telephone lines. When you download something from internet, the modem demodulates the analog signal over telephone line into digital one that can be accessed by your computer. Well, the modem operates on data link layer and it transfers the data in form of packets. However, the modem doesn't assure any security to your computer. Now, if there is only one device in the network, you can directly connect it with the modem. However, if there are several devices in the network, we require a device named router. Two main responsibilities of router are forwarding the data packet to an intended IP address and allow several devices to share same internet connection. Every data packet has some information in its header like sender and receiver's MAC address, sender and receiver's IP address, type and size of data, etc. The router scans the data packet and determine the receiver's IP address and then chooses the best route for data packet to reach its destination. Router operates on three layer, physical layer, data link layer and network layer. At network layer, router determines the logical address of sender and receiver. At data link layer, the router determines the physical address of sender and receiver. At physical layer, the router regenerates the data signal. Well, the inbuilt firewall in router helps in determining the potential threats. If you try to figure out the position of modem and router in between your ISP that is your internet service provider and your systems, then the modem lies between your ISP and the router and the router lies between modem and several devices connected to the same internet connection. Knowing modem and router in detail, now let us discuss the differences between them. A modem modulates and demodulates the signal between your computer and your internet service provider, whereas the router is a device that connects multiple networks together. When you upload something from your computer on internet, a modem converts digital signal from your computer to analog signal of telephone line, and a modem performs just opposite while downloading. On the other hand, a router analyzes the data packet and determines physical address in the destination field of that packet and route it to its final destination. Modem is there to bring information from internet to your network and router distribute that information to the specific computer in the network that has requested for that information. Modem is essential to connect your computer or your network to internet whereas a router is only to direct the traffic of packet to the specific devices. A modem operates only on the data link layer whereas a router operates on physical layer, data link layer as well as on network layer. A modem does not examine any data packet so there is always a thread that can enter your computer. Whereas a router examine every data packet before forwarding it. Hence implemented firewall in router will lessen the threat to your computer. A modem connects to a router via RJ45 and to a telephone line via RJ11. A router connects to your computer via RJ45. So this is all about modem, router and their differences. For more details you can refer our official website techdifferences.com. I had provided URL for the same in the description below. Please like and share this video with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel about technology. Keep checking the channel for further updates and put your comment and queries in the section below. We'll be back again soon with a new video. Till then, take good care of yourself.